444. Today, I got a ton of tiny things to do. Kathy is actually gone, she's actually gone downtown, into downtown LA. She's gonna be working with Bob and Sean, creating some sculptures for the movie Moana for Disney. I haven't seen the trailer to that movie. It looks really cool. I'm gonna put that down in the show notes down there. But like I said, I got a ton of small things to do, including some housework, some design work, some uh, desk work, and all kinds of, you know, just stuff. And if there's time, I might even take my mountain bike out. Now, even though I haven't ridden my bike in quite some time, there's still certain things that you don't forget. And I used to be very hardcore when it came to mountain biking. Seriously hardcore. So much so that my body is covered in scars from all kinds of different rides. My bike is a giant Kadex. It's all carbon fiber. Doesn't weigh that much. I don't know exactly how much it weighs, but really not more than 19 to 20 pounds, excluding all the crap that you put on your bike, including yourself. That was easily about a seven mile ride, not that far. But if you haven't ridden for quite some time, you can definitely feel it. But the worst place I feel it is right down there. Yeah, the, the rear end, that, the, the back. Got home 
I got a package. I don't, I don't know what, so. Aren't getting packages a fun thing? I mean, don't you look forward to getting a package even when you know what it is? And I'm, I'm not 100% sure what this is because I may have ordered it, but I, it might have been a while ago, so I'm not really sure exactly what it is. But I just love getting packages anyway. Oh, oh, oh. you know what's the best thing about this? This is in Tuos. This is a, a drawing tablet for the computer. Now, um, the best thing about this, although it wasn't really that expensive, it's a really great tool. It's uh, uh, I use it for the Mac back there. But the best thing about it was it was free shipping if I would wait an extra time. You know, it, it wasn't supposed to arrive until the 28th. I ordered this like, like four days ago. And it's here. Boom. I'm going to love this thing. Oh, can't wait. If I can open it. Oh, it's got a sticker. It's about 3.45 now, and Kathy is still in downtown. She got down there about 6.30, 7 o'clock, and she's been sculpting ever since. I've tried calling her a couple of times, and there's no answer. So she is like a sculpting fool. When these three get together, you never know what they can create. Don't all moms do this? <laughs> Peaches and coffee. Not a great combination. I've had a Wacom tablet for as long as I can remember. And the one thing that it, and the one thing that never really quite worked out was the fact that there was no touch sensitivity. That, this one changes that. So if you're into illustrating on the computer using Photoshop or Illustrator, then this tablet is for you. This is not a paid endorsement. This is just a cool item and it's really worth having. My first piece of art with this thing is gonna be the Wheels and Waves flyer number six. Six. I'm going to do a traditional illustration, but then I'm going to scan it and I'm going to put it in the computer and then I'm going to goof around with it. Now I've been sketching for 50 years, maybe maybe longer. Not really sure. I'm not even really want to get into that. Nothing ever really works better than an actual pen. This might, might change that. All the illustrations in my books are all done with traditional pen. There's no computer involved in any of these things. But the Wheels and Waves cards, a little more complex. I should be able to come up with something really cool this time. <clears throat> it's five o'clock. Kathy is still not back. In fact, I just got off the phone with her and she said she's gonna work till about 6.30, 7 o'clock. She was hoping to be able to vlog some of that stuff, but it's top secret and they don't want to show anybody. Tomorrow, we're going to the Vintage Trailer Bash. It's being put on by the Murphy Auto Museum. Automotive Museum. I don't know what I think. This Trailer Bash is 182 classic trailers, including the original GM Future Liner. That's happening up in Buellton. We're gonna be driving up there tomorrow, kind of midday, and then we're gonna be spending the night. Now, they won't have internet access, so that means I can't do a vlog from up there. I will be filming, I will be putting all the footage together, but there won't be a vlog tomorrow. There'll be a vlog the next day. But this weekend is also cruising for a cure on Saturday, and then a huge car show on Sunday up in Montecito. It's gonna take over all of downtown Montecito. Yes, this is my underwear drawer. I got a few things I gotta wrap up before we go to, back tomorrow. Kathy's coming back late. I gotta make myself dinner. I gotta make dinner for the dogs. There's all kinds of stuff I gotta do. But that's it. 
Oh, it actually worked. Although I will not have a vlog for tomorrow, check my Instagram, my Twitter, and Facebook. There will be photos galore and even some few surprises along the way. So that's it. We'll see you tomorrow. No, we won't actually see you tomorrow. We'll see you the next day. I'm just so used to saying that.